this is BBC News with the latest headlines. The Chancellor's promising to spend nearly £7 billion improving transport in England's city regions outside London as one of the spending pledges unveiled ahead of next week's budget. There'll also be half a billion pounds to support families in the budget, but the Labour Party calls it a smokescreen. A fresh push for people to get their booster jabs. It comes amid fears over rising coronavirus cases in England. I'm very fearful that we're going to have another lockdown Christmas if we don't act soon. We know that with, with public health measures, the time to act is immediately. The leading teaching union calls for tougher action against COVID in England's schools, saying staff are on their knees. Court documents show Alec Baldwin was told that a prop gun was safe in the moments before he accidentally killed a crew member on set. A warning that dog owners are pretending their lockdown pets are strays in order to get rid of them. And the coastal town that's received a £41 million donation from the woman behind Fisherman's Friend Cough Sweets. Good afternoon. The Chancellor is promising to spend nearly £7 billion improving transport in England's city regions outside London as one of the spending pledges unveiled ahead of this week's budget. Rishi Sunak says the transport revolution will bring public services in those areas in line with the capital. Labour says the government lacks a coherent plan to transform regional economies and to tackle the climate crisis. Here's our political correspondent, Helen Catt.